Good morning and welcome to the Wunschel Morning Shaharit service. My name is Patrick Aleph and I'm going to be subbing for uh, Rivka who is unfortunately sick today. Um, please let me know um, if we are coming through okay, if you can hear me all right. Um, also, I would encourage guests to please um, uh, create a username and password so that you can participate in the chat portion of the service. All you have to do is type forward slash login. That's forward slash, I guess it's this way, forward slash L-O-G-I-N and you'll be able to participate in the chat portion of the service. Uh, generally speaking, uh, we start about 10, 10.35, excuse me, and um, so we have a couple of minutes before we get started, but I wanted to let everyone know that we use the Wunschel Community Sidor. Um, unfortunately, uh, we don't have it below in the room because we um, had Rosh Hodesh services and we haven't um, put the Sidor back up, so I'm going to post a link to where you can read the morning Shahari service uh, online. If you do not already have a copy of this, you can uh, purchase a copy of this in an e-format that you can get from um, Kindle and Nook and iBooks, so depending on um, what kind of e-reader format you like, um, that's a possibility as well. Um, in addition to that, you can contact us directly, and we'll be able to email you a copy if you would prefer that. So I will post the link to that real quick here. It's at 3xdaily.org, and you just click on prayers and then click on uh, Shaharit, and we're going to do version 2, which is the updated version that we have here. Uh, we are going to do a slightly abbreviated version today. Um, so we will actually begin on page, um, let me see if I can find it, uh, page 7 in the written book. Um, and I'm so glad that everyone is here uh, to participate in the service, and we wish, uh, we wish Rivka a refruish lema, a healing of mind, body, and spirit, and hopefully Rivka will get better really soon. And we will be able to enjoy having um, having Rivka's service here with one shell. So um, another thing that I do that's a little bit different is I also play music in the service as well. So we're going to have a couple of sort of musical pauses uh, in the service where you'll get to hear some really cool Jewish music. So. Uh, we're going to start on page seven, recalling and returning to the covenant of our people and our faith. I am thankful for the eternal gift of our covenant, for making us partners in righteousness, tikkun olam in creation. You are the good that struggles within us and within all people in all ages to establish good in the midst of terrible darkness. I will seek after your light all the days of my life and remain confident that it is always there. As you have made a unique covenant with Israel, so you have made covenants with all people and all persons that may join with us in your work and in your service. For, for what are we without Hashem? Without you, the mighty are without strength. The renowned do not exist. The wise lack wisdom. Those who feel rooted in their land are as aimless as the winds. It is you who caused our mother Sarah to have child. It is you who rooted our father Avraham in your land. Without reference to you, our actions are meaningless and our days are emptiness. In the face of the Creator, we are the created, superior to no animal or plant or fact of nature. Still, you have chosen us to be your people and partner. I join with a thousand congregations and millions of your <clears throat> Israel that turn towards your sacred mountain. May your merciful presence soon return to Yerushalayim, Jerusalem, and bring peace to all its inhabitants. May you bring us together from the corners of the earth to join together in your holy land. We are the children of your beloved Avraham, with whom you pledged a bond over the body of his son, when you taught him not to forget love and compassion in the prosecution of our faith. We are the children of Yitzhak, the son bound upon the altar, terrified of all the evil in the world and in our own hearts, bound in darkness, the son who you saved and strengthened that he and we may never be consumed in our hearts by darkness. As you saved Yitzhak from oppression, save us and liberate us. As you saved Avraham from oppression, save us and forgive us. May we remember that we were bound in Yitzhak, 
when we find ourselves holding the knife and that we were in Avraham when we found ourselves bond. You are our constant redeemer, Baruch Ata Adonai Gael Yisrael. We are your firstborn, the children of Yaakov the trickster, who dressed himself like a beast and let his mind lay upon the cold stone, who by struggling with you found the goodness in his soul and became Yisrael, the wrestler, Yeshurun, the upright. May we always wrestle with injustice within and without us, and may we afterwards stand upright before you. Baruch ata Adonai haboer be'amo Yisrael b'shalom. I am thankful to you, our Holy One, who has planted holiness in creation and all of humanity. I pray that you will help me this day to see this holiness in my brother and sister. So a wonderful start to our service, a wonderful opportunity to think about those who matter, those who are important, and those who um, we stand together with, whether they be a part of the Jewish people or not. All right. Uh, the next part of our service is going to be a little bit of music. We're going to hear a really wonderful song called I Was the Desert by Girls in Trouble. This is a live performance from uh, the Atlanta Jewish Music Festival. It's a really, really, really good song. I think it's a really great song to listen to to start off your day. Um, it's actually a biblical parallel to the story of Tamar and Judah, and it's really great, and here it is.
It's a really wonderful song. Uh, we're going to move on to page 10, which is the Rabbi's Kaddish. May your name be great and holy in the world which you have made in your way. May the presence of HaKadosh Baruch Hu, the Holy One, blessed is He, be over you in your life and the lifetime of your people. May the Lord be blessed forever. The greatness of HaKadosh Baruch Hu, the Holy One, blessed is He, is beyond all words. Blessed is Adonai. For those who choose to be chosen, for students and teachers of Torah, here or anywhere, may we all have blessings, may we all have peace and life. And a blessing before the Shema. Baruch Ata Adonai, Yotzer Hamerot, may we join your servants on earth and in heaven in proclaiming Kadosh, 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 Adonai Zavot, Mekol Horetz, Kuvodo, Baruch Vod Adonai, Mim Kumo. We stand together before our King and recite the words of the Shema. Shema Yisrael, Adonai Eloheinu, Adonai Echad, Baruch Shem Kavod Malkuto Le'olam Va'ed. You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart and all of your might and with all of your being. These words will be in your heart wherever you go and on your arm wherever you do. They shall be a reminder above your eyes that you may look upon your neighbor with love. They shall be upon your door and upon your gate. When you have bound yourself to Torah, the Lord will grant you rain in the proper season. The rain that falls on your fields will also fall in your hearts and will cause them to give fruit. You will eat to contentment and be satisfied. Indeed, you will rejoice with your brothers and sisters with what the Lord has granted you. If you disobey his word, the heavens will close and there will be no rain. You will disappear from the good land the Lord is giving you. Therefore, teach to live your mitzvot. In every day and at every hour, teach me to be holy like you are holy, good like you are good, and loving like you are loving. Remind me of your mitzvot that they may guard me from the seduction of my heart or the wandering of my eyes, for you are my redeemer. All right. Now uh, we're going to actually skip backwards a couple of pages, and we're going to do a... Uh, Mourner's Kaddish, it's actually a poetic version of the Mourner's Kaddish. Um, it was written by our friend Katsira, who does the Rosh Hodesh services once a month. Uh, we just had it last Monday. We have another one next month, I believe, on the 4th. Um, so it's a really, really wonderful poem. Uh, typically, the, Kod the uh, Mourner's Kaddish is a glorification of God's name. And it is said from the perspective of of the deceased person by those that are alive. Um, this is a little bit different though um, because it is going to be said from the perspective of the living person um, about the deceased. So it's a little bit of a different variation. I'm going to start with a little bit of Hebrew just to get us going and then we'll move into the, uh, the actual Warner Scottish. Yit Kedal, Viet Kedash, Shme Raba. Yit Kedal, Viet Kedash, Shme Raba. I send you on with love in my heart, crying tears of joy for the life you have lived, praising the source of life for connecting our lives. I send you on to the next life. I send me on the way that you lived, embracing who you were, not the space that you leave, praising the source of life for allowing us to love. I send you on to the next life. I send you on without fear, I will not curse or rend my garments, praising the source of life for granting us time. I send you on to the next life. I send you on without praise, singing songs of joy for all creation, praising the source of life for giving us life. I send you on to the next life. I send you on with libations and toasts, drinking to health and drinking to life, praising the source of life for giving us words to share. I send you on to the next life. I send you on with stones, not flowers. I will not add death to death, praising the source of life for all creation. I send you on to the next life. Amen. And now we will do an Amida. I am grateful to you, protector of all, our God and God of our ancestors, Elohe Avraham, Elohe Sarah, Elohe Yitzhak, Elohe Rivka, Elohe Yaakov, Elohe Leah, Elohe Rachel. Adon Alam, master of the world, who created goodness, who inspires us to repair the world in compassion, king, queen, savior, and shield, blessed are you, shield of the patriarchs, shield of the matriarchs, and of us all. Master of the world, give us knowledge, 
after giving us knowledge, accept our repentance. After accepting our repentance, forgive our shortcomings. After forgiving our shortcomings, redeem us, heal us, bless our lives, and bring us together. After bringing us together, judge us fairly. After judging us fairly, defeat the evil in us. After defeating our evil, strengthen our inclination to do good. Now that we are holy before you, make the earth heavenly for us. Hear our prayers and make us worthy of your goodness. Baruch atah Adonai ha'el ha'kadosh. Blessed are you, Lord our God, the Holy God. Baruch atah Adonai ha'asei shalom. Blessed are you, Lord our God, who makes peace. Baruch atah Adonai shomei ha'tefilah. Blessed are you, Lord our God, who hears our prayers. It is the duty of those who choose to be chosen to proclaim your greatness. So we bow in worship and thanksgiving for the responsibility you have given us to bring the message of your oneness to the world. Know therefore this day and take to heart that God alone is God in heaven above and in earth below. There is no other. Melech HaMelechim, we long for the time when the world will realize perfection through your will and the work of our hands. And on that day, the world will embrace this oneness and they will declare Adonai is our God. a wonderful sort of closing Alenu, which is really, really a beautiful thing. Uh, I'm going to leave us with one more song. This is a song by um, a group called De Leon. It's a sort of Sephardic indie rock, and I hope you enjoy it, and I want to thank you again for coming to One Shoal Community Services. Uh, please support everything that we are working on. We have One Shoal, we have New Kosher, we have Punk Torah, 3X Daily, we have our Rosh Chodesh services, we have our Monday night Torah Together services, um, we have lots of great opportunities for people to volunteer, to participate in this online community that we've created, uh, so please get involved. You can email me, patrick at punktorah.org, and you can let me know kind of what you're interested in, what sort of things you like to do and how you would be interested in participating in the community, whether it's teaching a class at one shul, leading a prayer service, writing for our blog, helping to recruit new volunteers, maybe you like to podcast, lots of different opportunities there. In addition to that, we also have um, a need also for financial donations. You can do that through PayPal. You just PayPal punctora at gmail.com and um, any amount is always a blessing, even if it's just a dollar. Every little bit helps. Um, we operate entirely on donations from individuals, so we greatly appreciate anything that uh, you can give financially. Um, if you don't uh, use PayPal, you can also uh, send us a check in the mail. Uh, our address is on all of our websites. Our mailing address is on all of our websites. So, we will end with a little bit of Sephardic Indie Rock. Thank you so much for coming to One Shoal Community Services, and I hope you enjoy De Leon. <laughs>